What's going on, y'all? See Paris, 12 on apparel, where it may not always be right, but it's always going to be real. Today's video is on me refilling some refillable cartridges with sublimation ink from Cosmos Ink. Show y'all the steps I take to do that and how to clean, how I clean the needles and stuff afterwards. Like, comment, subscribe. See y'all in a second. I'm going to be refilling these uh, Cosmos Ink cartridges, sublimation ink. Or the CMYK colors. And I'm just going right through that paper I made a hole the first time. Feel it slow. Try to reduce the air. Let's put it in, angle it towards that little chip down there. Squeezing in slow to reduce bubbles. And I just went <clears throat> a little bit over the 10 and I filled that one. Let's replace my plug. Process. 
This is the second time I've used them. I got a lot of prints. This bottle still, these bottles are still pretty full. Dang, getting ink everywhere. That part ain't supposed to happen. Some of these had ink in them and I forgot. Not all of them. The blue and the it's empty. That's about full. Squirt the rest back into the bottle. And I see with this one you can see like this is the second time I used it. I got a lot of prints out, you know, trial and errors, <laughs> more than anything, but still a lot of ink. It's well worth the, the purchase. So with these black cartridges, the black cartridges are thicker, they're bigger because you use more black. had this issue the first time.
Black bottle is a little, the ink is a little bit lower. I think that's what it is because you use more. So I had to get in the bottle. I couldn't go through that hole. It's working now. I'm not going to fill it all the way because there's still a little ink in there. Just like that. Right, so I'll clean the body. I'm gonna go on and show y'all how I clean them, rinse them out. I'm gonna just put a little water in here. My sink. That's the blue. You can see that blue. Even in the water is vibrant. I'm gonna just gonna run it through the needle a few times. is clear. So I'm going to just pull this syringe out. Set my needle over here on my rag. And then the water through there. Do that. Damn. Straight like that. Work. 
Então... Last one. That's magenta right there. So then I just leave those there to dry. And then next time I need them, they dry it out, put them back in my box, they ready to roll. So then I'm gonna just put them back in one by one. Starting with my black. Just till I hear that click. Then this cyan. Magenta is next. Just double checking my plugs. And that click is in there. Last but not least, my yellow. Close that. So what I did was uh, just let it know, let that let the printer know that it wasn't original Epson ink, and it was okay to use it. So it cut out on the middle of a print right here, as you can see. So Let y'all see the print come out and put it into the video. Just told me on my computer that it wasn't original Epson ink, so told it to continue to see what happens. It didn't do this when I originally converted the printer over to sublimation ink, but in accordance to the uh, video by Angelo on Caps on Fire, he was saying it should have and it didn't. But I see this in a lot of them groups of men on Facebook where this happens after the fact, so we're just going to stall it out.
I just told it to print again, so we'll see. I'm not sure what those flashing lights mean. Got it. Saying there's an error in the wire. Here it comes. It shows shake a lot. I just got it sitting on top of a stackable. You see how much that is going rocking back and forth as it prints out. Me out right there, but what it did was continue this print. And here's the next one that I had it seen. I just did this print so y'all can see the process of it actually filling the cartridges and then me checking my colors, make sure everything is printed correctly afterwards. Boom, there it is. Print it out perfect. press this on a pair of socks and then so I'm gonna let y'all go it's still printing <laughs> but I'm gonna let y'all go it's again Cosmos ink man they got some good ink the colors is pop very vibrant you know what I mean but uh seek Paris man I'll see y'all later y'all have a good evening like comment subscribe Twelve on apparel, man. It might not be. It may not always be right, but I swear to God, it's gonna be real. So there you go. How to refill your refillable ink cartridges with Cosmos Ink. If you liking this content, man, like, comment, subscribe. Twelve on apparel. Again, where it may not always be right, but it's always gonna be real. See y'all next time.